welcome back to my channel I look a mess oh god anyways um so today we are back we are doing a grocery haul but this time it is a sam's club haul this is the very first sam's club haul on my channel i had a membership for like i want to say like four or five months now and i just never went because sam's club is like low-key far um and every time i had planned to go something came up and i just didn't end up able to go so now today we finally went to sam's club so you guys are gonna see a really really big haul oh look at my car her okay as my kids are fighting in the background my car y'all look at this okay yes i blinged it out hella bling hella bling don't mind my mess oh my god look at my golden girls mints though that the kids ate most of i have this one how cute <laughs> and then my lotion yo if you guys have eczema this has been working wonders for my eczema no lie you find it in like the health and beauty section like near the first aid stuff when you go into walmart or target yes that and then some random dollar bills for the strip club no i'm joking <laughs> i got my hand sanitizer yes my fancy hand sanitizer because i follow tiktok trends to no end my sam's club drinks my trusty dusty lip gloss and chapstick and inhaler you know this is just the front of the car i'm not gonna show you the back because the girls were saying they low-key made a mess but yeah you can kind of see <laughs> my bag holder that's really for the diaper bag, so I don't know why the diaper bag is, like, back there, but whatever. So like Anyways. I was saying, we're going to be doing a Sam's Club haul. We're just kind of getting everything out of the car right now. Well, I'm doing an intro. Gio's getting everything out of the car, and Zuri's supposed to be holding the door open for him, but I guess he doesn't like the way that she's holding the door open, so that's why they're fighting. So, yeah, I'm going to end this intro and um, go monitor that and separate that and also set up everything for this haul. I got a lot of stuff, but that was kind of to be expected because it's my first time back at Sam's in like years. And, um, yeah, I kind of have been waiting to do like major grocery shopping just because I knew that this trip was coming up. So we've only been grabbing little stuff here and there. And yeah, I, everything that I got is like mainly stuff to save up. So we're not going to end up going back to Sam's for like a couple of months. Thank God. But yeah, let me go do that, and I will be back with the haul. All right, y'all, so this right here is everything that we got. I'll start over here because it's easier. We got the toilet paper. We got the paper towels. Got baby wipes. I only get my diapers at Target because I like the Millie Moon for her. That's the best brand so far. So I don't buy diapers in bulk unfortunately because they don't have them in bulk. back here i got a gallon of milk normally i would get organic but they were out of organic whole they only had organic two percent and miss picky pants will not drink two percent so i got a regular gallon of whole milk just because we have like not enough milk left for the week for her so i figure she'll just drink that got the big thing of the chicken bouillon powder because it was so cheap for this big thing it was like five dollars and I figured that's a good deal because anytime I need chicken broth, I can just use that. Got the value pack of Mexican cheese and sharp cheddar cheese. They didn't really have like a good variety of cheeses today. I don't know what happened, but yeah, that's what they had. So that's what I got. I got bacon. What is this? Three pounds of bacon. So these are going to go in the freezer until we need them. I've been dying to try these pepperonis. I've heard that they're amazing and we're gonna probably make some pizzas and calzones and all sorts of stuff. So I'm actually gonna separate this and freeze some and keep some in the fridge. And we got the uncured honey ham because we need some sort of sandwich meat for the Allergy week. season is coming up. So I got the kids some allergy medicine. These come in a two pack for $7 and change. Like I think it's like $7.98 or whatever it is. But I got two of them just to make sure that we are stocked up because allergy season is supposed to hit us crazy this year. So there's that. I got the Chef Chamois garlic butter and the Chef Chamois honey butter. Got some Kerrygold butter just to have regular butter because we don't have any. Up here, I got the chicken apple smoked sausage. I don't know what I'm doing with this yet, but I will figure it out. It's going to go in the freezer in the meantime. Also got the beef smoked sausage. Again, don't know what I'm doing with it, but it's good to have. And I'm putting it in the freezer. 
Am I crazy? Absolutely. Yes, I did buy three of the Tabitha Brown Sunshine Seasonings. I would have bought more, but I thought like maybe they would look at me like I was crazy. So I only bought three. Um, looking back, I really wish I would have at least bought five, but it is what it is. Hopefully by the next time I go that they're not completely done with it. Got some Sazon in the big pack because we never have Sazon. We never have Found enough. these lemon blueberry soft baked clusters. These are granola. So we're going to eat that with some yogurt. That just sounded good. Then I got some bacon crumbles. This is good to have for anything that you need. Don't mind my soda. <laughs> got a big thing of minced garlic because we run out of this real quick. And this was only $4.98, I believe. Um, two packs of the Sam's Club hot dogs because we absolutely love these. These are my favorite. Got the picnic pack of ketchup, relish, and mustard because summer's coming. And so we need a lot of this stuff. Hot chocolate mix was on clearance, so we grabbed the big canister. That actually lasts until 2024, I did check. So if we don't get to open it this year, we can end up using it for winter, this upcoming winter. You know what I mean. I got a value pack of penne noodles. They didn't have any other of the Members Mark brand noodles, so I didn't get any others. But it's fine because these will do for what I need them for. And to be honest, Walmart sells like regular spaghetti noodles for like a dollar or less, I think. I don't know. It's been a while since I checked. But either way, regular spaghetti noodles is not hard to find. But I have this on hand if I need noodles for something. And yeah. Over There's here, that. I got these frozen stuffed shells. So these are just going to go in the freezer. These are really, really great to have on hand if you need something super quick for dinner. Um, got these southern style chicken bites. I'm going to make the chicken littles that Chick-fil-A sells. With that, I just have to run to Walmart and get the... What are those? Like the little rolls or whatever? I don't know. I know it when I see it. You'll see it eventually. Um, got this huge bag of bird's eye garlic chicken pasta dinner this is only gonna last us one dinner but i figured let me still grab it because there's gonna be a night when i just want something super quick to throw on for them and yeah that's why i only grabbed one because i know and i probably would have grabbed more if they had other flavors but they didn't have any other flavors so i just grabbed because i was running out of space we got a box of cinnamon rolls we tend to go through this quick because we use it on the weekends for breakfast sometimes and I found this corn dog wrap kit. This comes with two packages of the corn dog wraps and two packages of the hot dogs. So I figured I'll do that for a weekend for the kids. Over here we have juices. We love the Kedem's grape juice. And we got some Mott's apple juice. Um, beans. We can never, never, ever have enough beans. Um, so I got the eight pack of red kidney beans and the eight pack of pink beans. This I thought was amazing. So they had rotisserie chickens just cut up and refrigerated for $3.98. So what I'm going to do with these, we're not going to like heat it up and eat it like that. I'm actually going to take all of these off the bone and shred it and then freeze it in bags to have. Like if I ever am doing a recipe and I need shredded chicken, instead of cooking down chicken breast and doing that, or opening up cans of chicken that I can save just in case I really need cans of chicken for something. I have this. Also on the top of pre-cooked chicken, I found these fire grilled chicken breasts. They were a little bit on the expensive side, but I've really been wanting some grilled chicken lately. So I figured I could splurge on at least one pack. I really wanted two just to have for two different meals. But yeah, I definitely can't wait for grilling season to start. Moving forward, Zuri picked out some rain boots. They're supposed to light up. Do they light up? Yeah, they light up. They sure do light up. So she's going to be shining in the rain. Um, up here, we have these SpongeBob soft baked bars. They're birthday cake flavored. I don't know what they are, y'all. I think that's like some sort of a dessert. I have no clue. But the kids will eat it. It was on clearance. So yeah, got some packs of mashed potatoes because we use that pretty often and it's also great to have on hand some Ritz crackers this is the big box because we go through crackers like crazy Gio picked out this shrimp alfredo with penne this is a frozen thing it just comes with three bowls so he can have that 
you know, after school or whatever, maybe for lunch on the weekend. We got some Nature's Valley oats and honey bars. We got the Nature's Bakery fig bars. The kids love those and I actually eat those a lot too. Then we found these Nature Valley soft baked muffin bars. So they definitely wanted to try that. And that sounds really, really good. And I know Zaylee would probably eat that. Now as moving well. on to meat, which is what I actually really, really went there for, other than the allergy medicine for the kids. That and this was the main reason that I went to Sam's Club. So I will start over here on sale. They had some what are these like sliders because they're not big enough to be like actual hamburgers so I guess they would be sliders unless I like press them down and then they're just you know thin patties but who knows we'll see we'll see what we do with that but those were on sale for $9.60 over here I got chicken thighs look at the price $7.53 for this huge pack this will be split up into two dinners for us so for $7.53 that's actually really great Boneless, skinless chicken tenderloins for eleven twenty six. I think I'm gonna split this up into two different dinners as well. Chicken drums, holy cow, that price! You can't beat that. Also, two dinners for five twenty five. These are chicken breasts, seventeen fifty five. A little bit high, but it's actually not that bad because I'm gonna split this up into three, possibly four dinners. We'll see once I fully unwrap it and see how big those breasts are and <laughs> boy that sounded off we'll see how big each uh piece is and um yeah well y'all get the point let me move on <laughs> got three packs of ground beef this was 13.44 so again three meals um got this pack of boneless pork chops this will be two different dinners i love this recipe that I got from HelloFresh. So we love to buy boneless pork chops to remake that. So we'll do this for two dinners, $9.45. And lastly, they had women's hoodies on clearance. So I grabbed one for me. And to be honest, I could have went with a large. I got an extra large, but I could have went with a large. And I realized when I was picking it out that I never have any just like plain black hoodies so i definitely needed one so i grabbed and this then one. they had the carter's baby clothes on clearance so i got zaylee this outfit it was only four dollars i think it's so cute and then this also was four dollars and it comes with two outfits so yeah definitely cute definitely a great buy because she always needs more clothes she's always ruining clothes always needs more so there's that so that's it for everything that i got i look like crap i'm tired y'all i'm tired it's been a long day it's been a long day that was a super long drive and then going through the store with the kids okay my sanity's not all the way there so don't mind the way that i look um yeah this was a lot of stuff we gotta get it all put away it was a lot of money <laughs> it was almost 600 not quite 600 almost 600 but i did go over my budget my budget was 500 and i spent 573 and change then there was gas <laughs> i did buy gas at sam's because with your membership you get discounted gas it's amazing so i want to say with gas that was probably 600 <gasps> oh but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this sam's club haul and i will see you guys again in another video bye everybody <laughs>